Alright, I'm doing another video of my helmets because the first one was crap, so. This is my World War II German helmet that I got from my grandpa after my Uncle Pete passed away. This was originally my uncle's. But after he passed away, I got it. I am going to buy a liner for it because the liner is completely destroyed. So I don't have it anymore. This is the guy's name. If anyone could help me by looking, well not looking, but if anyone could help me tell me what size, or like if it's an M40 or something, you could someone leave a comment after I'm watching and see if they could just need some help. But it's, I have, I use that book, The Value. I use that book right there, The Value. I found this helmet in that book, and it said it was, Everything on it, 800 to 850 to 1000. So, I thought that was pretty cool. So, on to my Vietnam helmets. I got this helmet at a surplus store down in Linwood for $30. This one was used in battle during some of the more hard areas, some of the more battlefields in Vietnam that were harder. That were most guys are killed then. Guys, I had, this one has the guy's name in it. It was War Charlie. Charles C. Morris was his name. He was not killed in Vietnam. He lived one of the 40 years. I, my, my thanks go out to him for serving. Not to this helmet. I, I got this one at the same, at the same, I guess I got the store name, but that's I think where I got that helmet. Same price, I just, this one was never really used, but it was for paintball, that's why I repainted it. Yeah, put some dent, no, not dents, but something else, some, some scratches on it. This is what I think maybe a World War II US training helmet and this is not the real liner. This one some shitty one. I came with it. But otherwise this helmet's still in good condition. I got it for forty dollars at an antique store and it's a homish. So I'm still doing I'll do another video when I find some more research on this helmet, but so I'll see you guys later.